at five, a Columbus native and Ohio University graduate is hitting it big on TikTok. Becca Moore is an online influencer, but her career started when she went after a nine to five job. Brad Johansson explains what changed in tonight's Tell Me More. I do freelance marketing. That's what I say. That's what you say. I just was desperate to graduate so that I could make a salary. Something. Yeah, anything. She accepted a 9 to 5 job, but just before she started, her boss called. I found your Instagram and you have to take it down because I was posting in bathing suits and it was like a bad look for the company. So Becca went social digging. I looked up the guys that were already working at that company and they all had bathing suit pictures. So before you started the job, you quit. Yeah. <laughs> and started posting on TikTok. So something hit. Mm -hmm. Yeah, the first video I ever posted hit. This is Blake, he was super fun, except the state party was three years ago and he still hasn't changed it as his profile picture on every single dating app there is. And I would rate them like 12 out of 10 or like 13 out of 10. And everyone was like, what? Why is she rating them so high? Her sarcastic humor created a brand, attacking the double standard that made her quit that nine to five, listing the things that men shouldn't be allowed to have. Number two, blankets. Those aren't for you. But she did need money. And then I tricked them into hiring me. Town Hall. Yeah, Town Hall. A bartending job at Town Hall with no experience gave her plenty of time to post. You fired her. I didn't want to. <laughs> <laughs> I had to. Because she didn't show up for her shift, she was in Nashville doing a frat move podcast. You could probably use a bartender with that kind of influence, couldn't you? <laughs> no. Is you, you coming back to us or what? The answer is no. We caught Becca back in Columbus visiting her folks, but Nashville's home for now. Travel's constant, like her recent trip to Coachella that went viral involving a kind Uber driver whose daughter has cancer. Becca reached out to her 900,000 TikTok followers to help Myra's treatment, setting a goal of $1,000. How many dollars do you know where you are? 250000 Ninety percent of Becca's nearly one million followers are women, and advertisers pay for that influence to wear their clothes, their makeup, hold their products, and now Amazon Prime wants her to review their content. Put your makeup on. That will. Uh, that's a check worth like 10k. <laughs> and yeah. if you hold something, that's worth 10k. Yeah. My low months are like 10k a month, and then. And your high months? I'm making like. 50K At 23, she appears to have found a job. Fun fact, my parents have been divorced for 15 years now. And everything and is content. As long as people care about my life, then I can, I'll have a job. If you have a story that needs to be told, email me at bjohansson at wcmh.com so I can tell people more and we can share it with everyone.